Hi and welcome to the play review of Inform Anthony Mounier. He plays left wing from Montpellier in Liga 1. He's got a high attacking work rate and a low defensive work rate. He's got a 3 star weak foot and he's also got 3 star skills. So looking at his in games, his standouts are his 91 curve, 90 crossing, 87 reactions and 87 sprint speed. We've also included the gains from his non-inform as well. So you can always pause the video for a close look at his stats. So this is the team we're going to be using Mounier in. Uh, we use the 4-3-3 League 1 team with Mounier at left wing. So now on to how we felt about Mounier. Uh, I think the main news for Mounier would be as we used him out on the left wing. With his high low work rate, he'll always be looking to make runs on the left wing. This allows you to make use of his biggest weapon which is his crossing. He did whip him some cracking crosses and he's got 91 curve as well which means it makes great teasing crosses for the goalies. On a lot of the crosses you can see it just curves away from the keeper landing straight on the head of his teammate. So obviously for the back post cross it's perfect. Crossing it in, curves just away from the goalie. And the goalie's stuck in no man's land, he's got no chance. But sometimes we did feel he was slightly isolated on the left wing, so we did change it up. We tried a 4 3 2 1 as well, changing it on a few games at half time to see how he'd cope at left forward. And he does have the agility and pace to beat defenders. We did manage to score quite a few on his left foot with him being at left forward. Once he gets into that position near the box, he is good enough with his finishing to score a lot of goals. His only downside was with him being left footed and only having a three star weak foot as well. It did let him down. He's always favouring his left and it didn't make the most of him being up there at a left forward. I think you would be better off with a right footer in that position or at least with a left footer. Make sure he has at least four or five star weak foot. But when he did get into the position, he did doesn't appoint with his shooting. I did, I did have some nice finishes on his left, nice volley, a couple of nice finishes, ghosting past the players. His only effort with his right was where he drifted across the box and fin had a nice finish on the volley with his right. And that was his only effort really on his right. His others were a bit wayward with his shots with his weak foot. So it would be a good idea to use the swap wings mentality as well. Not a lot of people use it in game. But if you're stuck like that, if you really want to use a left footer on the left. If you want to use him as that left forward, use the swap wings. It'll be popping up on the right to make use of his left foot in a more advanced shooting role. So let's have a look at Mounier's performance stats. In 10 games he scored 8 goals and managed to get 6 assists. So all his stats are down the left hand side there. His goals are on the right and in the bottom right there's a position map showing his goals and assists. So you can have a look where he's been uh, doing his job from. You can always pause the video if you want a close look at all these stats. So overall we're going to give Mounier an 8.5 out of 10. Solid player with great, has great wing play with his high attacking work rates. Always getting down that left wing. Then he's got his quality crossing as well. And also decent finishing as well when he does get into the shooting position. I would say well, he is best suited to a left winger. Even even on a 3-5-2 play him on the left. He's going to be getting up, up the pitch down that left hand side. Whipping in the crosses for you. So finally on to his positives and negatives. His positives are he's got decent pace. He's got great crossing as we said. 90 crossing. He's got decent shooting when he does get in the right position. He, he does finish quite well. And his price, his discard price, you can pick him up for 10k or even under. On to his negatives. His negatives really, we've only put a 3 star weak foot. With him being an advanced player, a 3 star weak foot on his left, on the left hand side, isn't the best. And 3 star skills, they are enough, but he would benefit a lot more for 4 star skills on that left wing. Using a bit more variety to beat the players, it would be a high, slightly high rating if he had his 4 star skills. So thanks a lot for watching lads, leave a like if you did enjoy the video, it would help a lot. And subscribe if you're new, we've got tons of stuff coming up. Once FIFA 15 comes out, we'll be doing tons of player reviews, loads of squad builders, plenty of stuff to keep you coming back. So thanks a lot for watching lads, cheers.